And so he'll buy five personal factors to consider beyond cost. And the first one is simple. How often do you want a new car? Leasing gives you that big push to get a new car every three years or so. And when the lease ends. And so how often do you want a new car? And that's the question you have to ask yourself. And if you do go that route, how well do you trust the car dealer? Leasing is a more complex transaction that requires closer contact with the dependence on the dealer. I want you to understand that. And then, of course, how much do you drive? Lease vehicles are subject to mileage limits as well as fees for excess damage. And so that could be a major factor if you plan on driving a vehicle a lot or if you're in a rough terrain and end up treating it roughly. And so these are things you really want to consider. And how stable are your finances? Your stability is important. You may be much better off not being contracted by a lease. And so if you're not sure of your family business situation, will be in a couple of years, leasing may not be to your advantage. And of course, how will you use the vehicle? Because status is important. Because leasing costs are generally lower in the beginning, you can lease a vehicle that you couldn't afford to buy. And so you may end up putting yourself in debt. And so these are some of the factors that I want you to consider beyond cost when you're considering do I lease or not. And here's a big question everybody has been asking. How do you make your personal home your place of business? Well, according to the IRS, you must carry on a bona fide business. By bona fide, they mean the business part of your home must be exclusive, regular, and for your trade or business. But the business part of your home must be one of the following, ladies and gentlemen. Your principal place of business. Check, this is where I deal with my customers. A place where you meet and deal with customers in the normal course of trade or business. Check, this is where I deal with everyone. Accept your structure you use in connecting with your trade or business. In English, this just means the biggest room in your home. Because I want you to understand you get tax advantages according to the square footage. And so we definitely encourage all clients to choose the biggest room in your home, usually the living room, when you choose your uh, structure that you're using for trade or business.